COVID-19 Diagnostics Let's begin with the nasopharyngeal swab. The patient should be alert and cooperative. Allow them to first blow their nose. The patient should sit in a relaxed and comfortable position during the sample collection process. Tilt the patient's head back slightly. Stand slightly offset from the patient to avoid the risk of contamination in case of a sudden cough or sneeze. Be sure to advise the patient of potential discomfort during sample collection and let the patient know that they are welcome to close their eyes. Sample collection should only be completed using sterile swabs made from artificial cotton with flexible plastic shafts. Hold the swab like a pen between the thumb, index, and middle fingers. Maintain a loose grip that allows the swab to accommodate any resistance encountered during sample collection to read the swab horizontally into the left or right nostril. Carefully advance the swab while maintaining a course that is close to both the septum and the floor of the nose, parallel to the palate. Do not advance the swab upwards, but instead straight back until resistance is felt as the swab reaches the posterior nasopharynx. When collecting samples from an adult patient, this corresponds to a travel distance of approximately 5 to 6 centimeters or 2 inches. Leave the swab at this depth for a few seconds while gently wiping the wall by twisting the swab shaft. Slowly and gently remove the swab. 